power power plant functions in its physiology on the regulation of its plant growth hormones. Farmers don't like to wear hormones, so we could use plant growth regulators. Would you like to wear a hormone or not? That's what, exactly what they are. A plant has hormones just like a person does. I'm going to try to explain to you how they work and what we can do about it. But the whole idea is this. If we're going to pay $350 for a bag of seed corn, how are we going to get the genes in that plant to do more expression to give us a higher yield? That's the end game. That's the profit game. Because the genetic expression for the plants that we plant are about 35% of the top. We can get 600 bushels of corn, you know, most of us get 150 to 200 tons. How do you get more? How do you make that plant act differently? How do you make that plant more productive? These are things that we haven't been taught. I want to spend a few minutes trying to teach you about some of the approaches we use to doing this. The first thing I want to emphasize is this. A seed that's raised on a mother plant that is stressed will never give you as high a yield as a seed raised on a mother plant that's not stressed. Think about that. The seed is the fetus of a plant. And you all know that the fetus is formed inside of a stressed mother or a stressed animal. It's not going to be as productive. It's going to have more abnormalities in the seed that's formed in the mother. <coughs> when you plant that seed, not knowing where it came from, all they tested primarily is germination. The idea is, no matter if the soil is wet when it's plant, if it's cold when it's plant, if it's compacted when it's plant, how do we give that chance, that seed, the best chance to germinate and come up and survive? This is really critical. And it all has to do with how we can affect that baby at the time it's born. The germination is a birth of that baby seed, that, that seed is. If we can make it strong, then the period of germination is slightly thereafter, you have more seed come up healthy, and you have more seed that's seedlings that are the same height. We're going to see that out in these pots. This, these pots are found in very cold wet conditions. You're going to see where the bioforge was used on the baby seed to take the stress out of it and where it wasn't used. I didn't do the population count, but it's at least 30% more stocks, maybe 40%. <coughs> All because the baby was made stronger. That's the only reason. Now, this leads me to a project I'd like to have you do, so if you come back sometime later.